Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Pharaoh A New Era. We are at the end of the archaic period. That's right, the end. Final mission for first two. You get to choose which one you do. Uh, and yes, you only get to do one of them as part of the campaign anyway. As you recall, there was in the... I can just actually just go and show you. There's a mission selection. And I'm pretty sure you can just go do... Pick whatever you want. Yeah, archaic period. And you pick whatever you want. And you might be wondering, so are you going to do both? Oh, they're in red if I've beat them. And they're not in red if I haven't beat them. There's a lot of missions coming, my man. Ooh. Oh, there's even Cleopatra. Interesting. So the original game ended here. Um, all these here are from the expansion. Anyway, we got a ways to go, as you can tell. I... let me see. Where did I stop? I believe I stopped at Menad Khufu. It's one of these two, I think. Or it's one of these two, but I think it's one of these two. Pretty sure it's one of these two. Well, let's not get let's not get into spoilers. Um, we'll figure it out. I'll tell you. I'll recognize the map, and I'll actually just tell you when we reach the point I had reached. But yeah, uh, we're gonna go back to the campaign, though. Uh, you might be wondering, am I gonna do both? At first, I thought not, because, again, I didn't finish my playthrough of the original. I got fed up with the military and could not stand to play the game anymore. There were a few other issues, but that was the main one. There were a few other bugs in the original that could be annoying sometimes. Um, but so far, they seem to have fixed my issues with the original, so... I'm down to try and do all of the missions, so let's just start with one of them, and I'm gonna... Next video is gonna be the other one, picked from Mission Select. The only difference, really, is that I'm not gonna be able to carry over money from my salary from the previous mission, which is not the end of the world. I'm trying to play without using those as much as possible. Unless I'm at the end of the mission, I need to speed up the kingdom rating. It's pretty much the only time I'm gonna use it. Um, so mission selections like this. One thing to mention, for those of you who don't actually know Pharaoh, uh, neither the old one nor the new era one, uh, there's all, when there's two missions like this, there's always one of them that's more military focused and one of them that's more, uh, well, not peaceful, but there, there, there can still be military in the peaceful missions, but generally the challenge is more towards getting your economy running and answering all the requests and whatnot. There, there's other challenges. The challenges are different. And see, the difference here is very clear because both of these are the introduction to the, um, the water, having boats. A beju forces you to fish for food and forces you to trade for economy. Bet it, you have rather easy food you just put farms in the floodplains and you can do whatever you want really um and then the economy is gold mines but then you're gonna get attacked slightly more and you need actual an actual navy to defend yourself see so the, the challenge is different they both build a monument a mastaba but i believe Bedet is only one mastaba and abidju is like three yeah, it's three Mastabas, including a medium one. Oh my, I did not know that. Interesting. We need to reach population of 2,500. Culture, 25. Prosperity, 25. Build the monuments. Kingdom, 60. We got a ways to go. I might... These are going to start being long. I'm... I'm going to start wondering if I want to split them in two videos or not. You let me know. Uh, what you think of having long because I think Timna was like an hour something already this might be even longer and it's gonna get longer before the end those are not the longest missions although <laughs> the way I played them in the original I tended to take my time and do a lot I don't know 
hippo skip Egyptian secret is that hippos can dance. Yes, which is of the most swag. There's a code, I believe, you can enter to make the hippos dance if there's hippos in your map. I don't know the code and I don't care to research it because I don't care. But, you know, you can make the animals dance if you really want to. It's nice to have these silly things in the game. You know something I realized too? I did not install this on my SSD, so the loading times are slightly longer than they, than they need to be. Abjadu, the burial place of our forefathers, has grown over the years into a sprawling necropolis of sacred tombs. Now, most noble men and women wish to make this their eternal resting place. To honor them, the new pharaoh, Kazakimwe of the Second Dynasty, has ordered the construction of three sacred mastaba tombs, one of greater size than the other two, for the local nobility. Pharaoh has also ordered the creation of a powerful navy based at Vedette. Abjadu, too, must support a modest fleet of combat ships if our shores are to remain totally secure. This will not be easy, as timber is scarce and our climate supports only a few sparse areas of forest. Cedar may be imported at great cost from Byblos in the land of Lebanon to the northeast. Fortunately, exports of our native papyrus will provide a means of offsetting this expense. There you go. That's how it works. The challenge of the sea. See, we're still in the tutorial. The game called the end of the tutorial like two missions earlier. We're still learning. And we're going to be learning for a while too. Like, we haven't found livestock. I'm pretty sure we get a tutorial for that too. Shipwright builds warships and fishing boats. Right, yeah. So you need a shipwright. You need to feed it wood, which you can't produce in, on most maps, but you need to feed it wood. And once it has wood, it's going to produce boats for uh, the buildings that want boats. So that's your fishermen. This is a fisherman on the image. Um, the military docks as well will require a boat. The fairies don't. So that's nice. Oh, actually, I believe, yeah, I was going to say, shipwright does not require materials for fishing boats. You need the wood for military vessels and transport ships. I don't know that you necessarily need transport, transport ships anymore, do you? How do you use transport ships now? I don't know. Also, crocodiles, because F me. Okay, uh, I paused it. I shouldn't have. Let's speed it up and see what kinds of requests we get. We're gonna need fairy. I remember this map very well. I remember both maps very well, because I had a lot of fun on both. Like, just, I took my time and I had a lot of fun. We're gonna want a fairy here, because this is where we get most of our... Um, I don't remember. Reeds. Reeds. This is where we get most of our reeds for the papyrus. I... I wonder. Hold on. I want to test something. So... All of you. Road. I want to test something. I want to test to see if the reed uh, people are going to cross the ferry. You know? I just don't know. We're gonna need to make sure nobody dies. And then production, read gatherers. They're going to be pretty unhappy people, but I'm going to get to know what happens. Anyway, let's keep looking. There's nothing really new. Tribal schools, I don't think, are new. Dentist is new. It's another health service for the people. Speaking of, the people are arriving. The crocodile wants a piece of that person. Oh my. Well, didn't get it. That's good. See, they're gathering this. That's fine. I want to know if they're going to gather... 
Ah, shit, I don't- I need more workers. Get over here, you stupid workers! Uh, anyway, yeah, we get this, which is new. Nothing in the first year, that's interesting. Work camp, flax farm, barley farm, and the fishing. So we're gonna need this to have food. These two farms do not produce food at all. Oh, hold on. They're full. I could have just built a storage yard. But whatever. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, they do cross over. Oh, interesting. So I don't need to build... I don't need to jam all of the reed gatherers on this little island. I wonder if it's possible to give a lot of services to the people that would live on this island. Like, how many services could we possibly jam in there? I'm not sure. That's an interesting question. I do not know. Yeah, there's apparently an invisible river here. That's interesting. So we can put farms and all this. I don't know. Beer. Okay. He wants beer, so that's probably the first um, industry we're gonna want to build. We've got floodplains here, we've got floodplains that we can access from the top, up here. We're gonna want to colonize down here though, because our economy is gonna rely on disease strikes. Yeah, that's what happens, by the way, when disease hap happens. Disease strikes, man, and malaria. People are dying. Alright, doesn't matter. Anyway, uh, the test was successful. It's not super uh, efficient. But it's interesting. Anyway, we probably have most of our housing. We have like a big housing block here. Sure. We have a big housing block here, which is going to support some regatherers. We're going to have a bit of housing here. We can't have a lot of housing, but a bit of housing. We're going to try to have some decent living conditions everywhere. Like I said, I'm trying to make it so um, there's no slums as much as possible. I can at least feed them and give them a little bit of religion. I don't know how well they're going to be off, but they're not going to be slums, so that's nice. Anyway, I should go back to looking at what we can do. We can produce flax and barley. Production. Um, sure. We can make... Okay, we can make both linen and beer as well. Shipwright for boats. Reed gatherers, sure. We cannot produce clay. We can produce bricks if we import clay and straw. But we can't produce um, clay itself. Again, also, we can't produce uh, clay for pottery. We can produce pottery if we import clay, though. Maybe we're going to want to do that. I don't know, do we? Not sure. Only one god, so that's real simple. Military, we can have some military, and then, yeah, warship or transport. I don't... oh. That's so that you can send your troops far away, I understand. Got it. The way it used to work is that your soldiers can't take the ferry. You have to build, like, a transport and then load your troops in the transport and then unload on the other and it's all really painful. <laughs> really, really painful. Alright, it's just brick layers because it's just master bars. Entertainment, nothing changed, beautification. Another important thing to check. What can we import and uh, export? It sells straw and clay. We can make bricks out of this. We can buy clay. We can also buy pottery, but it's cheaper to buy clay. 
so we should probably just buy clay. It's a water trade route. Oh, now that's different too. That's another thing that's different. So... You get, yeah, a dock. And now water trading goes through the dock. The merchant comes at the dock and then there's a delivery person that's going to come from the dock to whatever you're trying to buy to the storage yards where you can sell or buy whatever product is being sold or bought. So that, that creates another need for your city to try to have the storage yards that are going to enter... You, you, might, you should try to have the storage yards that are going to interact with the traders be as close to the dock as possible within reason but as close as possible because otherwise trading takes a long time and you're not going to do as much trading overall right so trading resets every year if it takes forever for one trader to get everything he wants i did not know that right click would close that window how do i move to bip okay i can't move the i can't move the this view at all it buys things I can't produce. It sells the wood. This is where we're going to need to buy the wood. Per widget, we can buy clay. That's wonderful. We can buy figs and other stuff too. We can buy chickpeas. It buys bricks, barley, and beer. We can overproduce beer and sell a little bit of beer to Menefer. It's not a big priority but it's something we can do just sell our excess barley and beer to Menefer. Beju's us Timna sells clay somehow oh yeah they did produce clay it sells also weapons and copper if you want to do some military which maybe I do I don't know we'll figure it out 2500 people at some point we're gonna need to Make them do something, you know. It buys linen, beer, fish, papyrus. It buys everything we have. And it's a land trade route, which is fun. This is going to be a, a trade route we're going to want. If only to sell our papyrus. Papyrus is, I believe, the highest priced uh, commodity we can sell. We can produce linen. It exports for a decent price. Yeah, Papyrus is slightly higher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna be... Um, gonna be opening a trade route with Timna for sure. Uh, nubbed. Sells clay, brick straw. Again, we can import clay from a lot of places. This is a water trade route water trade route. I'm just checking to see if there's a clay import that is... Oh, yeah. Timna. Clay import that is from land. Interesting. But it's mixed. Water trade route as well. Sells clay. Sells a bunch of stuff, really. It buys linen. It's another place that could buy our linen. Um, buys wood, but I don't, you know. I'm not going to buy it to sell it. That's You never do profit with that. So we establish Papyrus. We establish... We can sell linen at two places. And a lot of it too. We establish Papyrus and linen and beer actually. We do want to establish beer because that was the first order of business. That's, that was the first thing that was requested was beer. Hmm. And we're gonna trade with Timna and Bedet to begin with. I'm gonna try to establish. We're gonna mostly just sell everything, right? To begin with, we sell everything. Eventually, we're going to add schools and whatnot. Do we have a mortuary? We don't even have a mortuary. So, we don't even use linen. Linen is just going to be sold the whole time. Where do we put the linen? You know, there's farmland here. 
could be there. So housing block here, which is going to provide, well, kind of here, which is going to provide workers for a bunch of boat stuff here, I guess. Hmm. And maybe we're going to want either beer or linen right here. Sure. Um, and probably the other one. Beer or linen on one, beer or linen, and the other one on the other here. Probably. Going to want the farms there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least I think so. That, that, that's probably the plan. Contaminated water. Oh, that's probably because everything is sick and whatnot. I should restart the mission. <laughs> should absolutely restart the mission now that we have a plane. All right. I'm gonna pause this. I'm gonna try to set something up. I will. Uh, be right back. Mm. Okay, maybe I'll just press play on this. See what happens. There's more development planned, don't worry. Like, this is gonna come this way for these houses, and there's gonna be some development that can be here for these planes, which can come get the workers here. 
This is just the first step that's gonna get food and have houses with most of the services. Although, yeah, we're gonna be missing beer, pottery, linen. Yeah, I didn't build my reed. Oh, yeah, I also didn't build uh, these that I really should. These things I really should build. I'm gonna build them here. I need to build my uh, reed gatherers too. My whole papyrus industry is gonna be on this lane. This is papyrus lane. So there's gonna be the reed gatherers, a lot of them along here. I'm gonna establish that already. Reed gatherers. Yeah. There's this very awkward space here, but don't worry about it. There can be shrines there or something. A uh, couple, couple, probably a storage yard right here. I'm gonna start with that. You're gonna be... Except quarter reeds. I don't need to accept quarter reeds. I could just be only papyrus because they deliver to the papyrus makers directly. So it's not like I need to store some reeds. You know what? I don't. I don't need to store some reeds. Shoot. Except all. There we go. Um, and then we're gonna make a few papyrus makers. We're gonna make them further down here, maybe. For now. I don't know how many Papyrus Makers I can support with... Um, two Reed Gatherers. We'll see. I suppose we'll see. Where are the people? Oh, they're coming. I am indeed not connected to the Kingdom Road. There might be a problem at some point. Not yet. Maybe at some point. Okay, so we've got our first industry right here. These things are a problem. And I can't deal with them. I can't make an army and sit an army on top of their spawn point. To make sure they just die. And I hate it. So this is the very unreliable farms because crocodiles are going to kill the people working there. Well, shit. Crocodiles, stay away from me. I hold on. Let me Google. How do you deal with crocodiles now that you can't order your troops around? I mean, maybe towers eventually, but I don't have towers right now. Oh, you get the academy. Anyway, give me a second. Okay, kind of dumb. This game is still in progress, apparently. So somebody asked the question in the chat and the dev literally answered, we're planning to add something for that real soon. For now, just turn it off. <laughs> All right, sure. Okay. Well, shit. Oh, okay, there we go, they died. I like it. Much better. Okay, so as far as farms go, I've got this set up here that can get some farms here, and I can get farms here too. I believe... What's our biggest production? Technically, we're going to consume much more beer than we're going to consume linen because we're not consuming linen at all. You need a mortuary to actually need to consume linen. Otherwise, it's just a thing that you have. Um, but we're going to sell linen. Linen is worth more than beer by quite a bit, I believe. Beer is 140 and linen is 160. See, it's not the difference between these two. It's, it's, it's much bigger. So, hmm. 
I'm gonna start beer first because right uh, there's some requests for that too we're not gonna get a lot of beer to begin with we're gonna get some we need to be as close to the river as possible with the farms so It's not going to be super ideal, but it's going to work out, okay? We're going to do these for now. Block this off. And there's going to be... A work camp uh, over here. I can eat here, and I can even had add another one right here later. But yeah, okay. People need to move in. Times one point five. Times five. My city needs to come alive. Come on now. All right. The people have started to fish and stuff. There's people here too. We're not gonna get much in the way of barley uh, immediately. Where do we set up the barley industry? Hold on, let me let me check real quick. What kinds of boats? Oh, this the transports are two and these are three. I think we're gonna make a military here and a transport here and so the roads gonna go like this Ooh. and it's come come right down here this is very inefficient I can cut it up though Um, you can kind of cut it up like this. I'd have to plan how much I want, though. Like... Hold on. One, two, three, four, five... Yeah, that's good enough. Two, three, four, five... Probably like this. This works, surprisingly. Kind of. The... It only works if the... Services are up here, though. But they're gonna be, so it's fine. Alright, our beer production's gonna be somewhere in here. We're gonna have a storage yard dedicated to... Storage yard dedicated to... basically... that. Maybe I did the thing wrong though, hold on. Brewery... brewery... It doesn't fit super well, does it? I'm going to do this. And I'm going to have another storage yard right here.
Um, I don't need two storage yards, but I'm making two storage yards because you can't stop me, so... Well... Can I have linen over here? Beer over here? Sure, why not? Alright, you're gonna be the barley. And you're gonna be the beer. No, except, except none. Except Paul. <sighs> I could mix up my storage yards a bit more, but I find it easier to just follow what's going on with just this. We're not gonna need a ton of breweries to begin with. You went the wrong way, guys, but hopefully you can still make it back to the houses. Then Linen's gonna be kind of over here. Do, 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 do. Linen, Linen, storage yard. Storage yard? Sure. Oh boy. We need to improve working. We need to improve how many people we have, but we need more workers. Anyway. I should open my trade routes. I'm gonna open it to here. Mm. I think the road that's gonna go here will feed the Pottery, maybe the clay, because it needs to be close to the docks. Um, and there's going to be the some more work camps for the... Yeah, 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 yeah. Working it out. I'm working it out. Hold on. Those are going to be Fisher. Those, and I'm going to put some military buildings over here. Maybe? Uh, hold on. Well, there's gonna be a small inefficiency. Oh, I haven't done culture at all, either. I can fit it on this, maybe. Sure. Or down here. Doesn't matter, really. There's lots of places to put the things. Alright, well, I got a tiny bit of food, so people are still going to be moving in. Still missing quite a few workers. I'm going to speed it up a little. Oh, wait, before I do. Um, commerce. We're going to export when over. I'm going to keep 1200. Uh, because of requests and whatnot. And then papyrus, export. Went over zero. Got it. Cool. Papyrus is already accumulating a little. We're gonna start making money off of that. Mm -hmm. How does this fit? Yeah. Not very well. That's not what we're gonna be doing then. Um. Personal mansion could go there though, and there's still like a couple spaces for stuff around. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I'll um I'll cut for real now. We need to wait for food to start piling up so that, you know, be more people move in and stuff. Oh, I should yeah.
There you go. I fixed that part, at least. It's gonna cost so much, never mind. <laughs> That's the most cute. Okay, so I was skipping to, you know, wait for, um, wait for some money to come in and some workers to come in. This is putting his red square in the water. Because this is technically, I guess, a path that's so goddamn random. Why? Don't do that. I, I mean, I can fix it. It's annoying, but I can fix it. So we need to delete this, though. And that's the most annoying part. I'm gonna let these... Because I don't know what's gonna happen when I delete it. Um... You should not detect a road here anymore. And then... I'm gonna put it here. Yeah, to have it the same place here. Stop detecting a road there! You don't have a road here! Stop it. Stop it. No, stop it. You stupid fisherman. Well, I'm going to... It's not resetting it, so I'm guessing that it won't reset. It probably just resets when you load in and out. That's so silly. That's so goddamn silly. Does that mean if I put something here... No, okay, it's still detecting the roads properly. Aye, aye. Alright, I'm also going to just add a couple more, because... Food's not coming in fast enough. I'm not getting food to enough houses, so the houses are not evolving. Anyway, I'll go back to cutting until I have enough to build more development. Looking forward to that. Alright, um, I have a little bit of money. Unemployment is starting to be a thing that exists. Let's maybe develop a few things. So, we are missing... Oh, wait. You know what? I'm going to time-lapse it. Okay, okay, that's gonna be it for now for development. I created, oh, maybe, you know what, I just realized. I had thought of something. 
I'm gonna do this, and we're going to add a uh, little juggling booth right here. A little bit of entertainment for this island. I don't know if I can fit a uh, bandstand. Um, let's just say I put it here, like... Oh, I can fit it right, right here. You know what? There's gonna be a bandstand leading to the... Um, <laughs> leading to the uh, reeds. That's kind of funny. Alright, so the, the reason I wanted he this here anyway is um, I'm gonna want... If we're gonna build all of our warships, I'm gonna want road access right here so that I can have two warships right here. And then I can have... This is gonna be transport ships. I can have a third one here. Uh, warship. The road just extends to it. It's fine. Uh, and then back here I have a warship. I have another warship here. And I have a warship here. And this can be a transport again. I don't know. I don't know why I'm... Oh my god, 99. 91, but you know, the houses are evolving. We're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. Eventually. We fixed this as well. The food is coming in. Fine a fucking Lee. We're gonna get there. My bazaar really needs to feed these people. Please do. Where's the lady that feeds people? Lady that feeds people. Oh, it's at zero. Yeah, the problem is it, it it's still having trouble buying all the fish that it needs. It's eventually gonna catch up. The first time is always the hardest because you're filling up the houses. But then the houses consume kind of slowly and refilling them once they've been filled once is easy. Filling them right now is just taking a lot of tries. Oh, food. food got back to the market while the lady was over here so these guys get the food and not these idiots. Ha <laughs> Get wrecked! Um, okay, it's the farming season again. I think I'm gonna add... I know we're still waiting for workers to come in, but they're coming in. I'm gonna add... I'm gonna try to add some linen. Uh, I added some pottery, importing clay. I added a musical school and a juggling school. I'm gonna add most of my culture here, but like I had space here, it's fine. Uh, we're gonna be importing clay here, storing the pottery here. Um, oh shit, that's a problem. Oop. The storage yard is not finding anything. Yeah, now it's fine. This is just here to facilitate just the destination walkers walking where they need to go. Um, right. Oh, um, acknowledge. We're producing beer. Hold on. Can I tell my overseer to... Well, okay, hold on. I think I can tell you to not buy for the moment. You can manage your markets, and eventually you need... Because eventually you need to give just about everything here to everybody, right? Um, and... <laughs> Eventually, you need two two markets to be able to go buy everything in time to like distribute it. We don't. We're not too worried about it right now. But yeah, I'm just gonna stop buying beer for a second, so that it accumulates up to 800. Because distributing beer to these villa, these houses currently is not important. You need pots before you need beer, and we don't have any pots right now. Where are the land traders? I connected the road because I like to do that. Where are the land traders? I'm getting my clay from land. You know what I should do? I should open another trade route which would allow me to... You only buy pottery. I don't like it. I mean eventually I'm gonna want to open it. It's land and it allows me to sell some beer. Burr widget? Yeah I could buy clay even figs, but like clay and straw, actually. We're gonna want straw eventually. I'm gonna open this one. Wait, hold on, is there a better one? Bet it. 
You also sell clay and you buy linen. Oh, that's an even better one. And you are water train route. Yeah, I'm gonna want this one because uh, I can use it. I'm, I'm still gonna want other ones for straw, for example, but I'm not building bricks yet, so we're fine. I'm gonna build, I'm gonna open this one so that I have another outlet for linen later. Linen was what I was about to set up, and then I saw that I was still waiting for a lot of people to move in. Confirm. You've got bed it. Um, so there's another trader that can come in and feed me clay. There's two traders that can, that can come in and feed me clay. I am anxiously awaiting for, okay, well, see, we already had a delivery of clay. Here comes the clay. We already had a delivery of clay, so... We've got some pots. It's possible some uh, houses are gonna evolve. Receiving pots soon? I don't know. Yeah, see, they're getting the pots. And they probably have beer already, so we're gonna have a big influx of people. Um... I'm going to start building. Time for another time lapse. I'm going to start building. some shrines oh probably should have paid attention to that you know what I haven't done I haven't added a tax collector oh I haven't added a palace yet which is very silly of me I'm sure you'll agree I'm gonna put that here because I want to there you go. I'm even going to put down a personal mention while we're at it. Here we go. Having those in weird places, but here we are. And then we're going to have a tax collector. To the greatest, you know, displeasure of a lot of people. I guess I'll put it here. Nope. You shall not pass! Except you passed. I don't know how you did that. Still no food. Good lord. It's very hard. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Deliver. Sorry. You can start buying beer again. I'm gonna start producing linen. I will export when over zero because providing linen to the citizens is not super critical at this point. I don't mind selling the linen as I get it. Exporting when over zero. Wonderful. I put it here. I can put more linen workers here and have the papyrus workers somewhere else. I mean. Yeah. Should all be fine. Do, do, do. We did not produce a lot of flax this year. I got enough, like, for this guy. But next year, next year we're gonna get all these farms worth of flax. The problem is that the... Yeah, the floodings are very bad. Impressively bad. I don't know. Anyway, you know what? I have some money. Let's do some beautification. 
make our main living quarters more pretty. Kingdom standing climbs. Perfect flood. About time. Good lord. That was pretty rough so far. Alright, I don't need plazas over there. I could use a plaza right here though. Because that's that is going to affect um, the house. I'm gonna do some beautification. Crocodiles, because we're so close to the floodplains, you know? And then I guess a few more cats. Unless... Oh, hippos. Yeah, <laughs> hippos. There you go. Desirability. Hell yeah. More plaza. Why not? I mean, I can fit more houses here if I really want to. And, I mean, why not? You know? Oh boy. Where? Okay, I can end it here. I'm not sure. That 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 felt weird to me. Anyway, uh, we're going to put a shrine here, and the rest is gonna be hippo statues or something. I don't know why I'm paying so much attention to this little sideshow over here. But I am. Um, I believe I can put this. Yeah. There we go. Okay, something we're going to start doing. Okay, there's a lot of people coming in. Two additional workers required. That's nice. Something we're going to start doing then, that's the wrong button, we're going to start in... Oh shit, uh... Give me a second, I'll uh... Put some space. I need that storage yard to actually do its job. Uh... 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 Bricks. I do need bricks. Is it time to get started? I think I'm gonna build the master buzz like here, and I can have the guilds come in from here. I guess up. Okay, brickworks is gonna be like over here. Store it around here, maybe. Guilds and sure. Okay, hold on. Time lapse time. Okay, well, this is should be ready to accept bricks in a month, right? Oh shit, if he went this way, he might not find houses. Let me just build two of them. Just two of them to handle gifts. I'm gonna need two to accept gifts, there you go. Uh, while we're at it, wonders. Medium Mastaba is big. We're gonna put them here. Medium Mastaba is a thing. Small Mastaba is a lot smaller. Hold on. It's from this rock, it's up to this small rock right here. Medium Mastaba, in terms of rock, okay, it is one, two, three, four squares bigger, uh, longer rather, got it, so, hmm, Let's just say we put it here. Let's just say we put it here. Small master button. Rotate that. 
One, two, one, two. Rotate. It's even, I swear. Yeah, it's even. Anyway. One, two. And we've got our three master bus. I don't think you need them connected to the road. Unemployment at 1%. Well. I guess I'll add some uh, brick workers, brick layers, or whatever. Thirty workers. Yeah, well, I got some unemployment. I can handle it. I'm going to overseer, Mr. Overseer of Money. <sighs> net in and outflow. So far this year, net last year was negative 12, but I did a lot of construction. Exports earned a lot. Uh, imports cost very little. Little. So let's do something. We're going to start trading a bit more. Commerce. We are going to... I don't have the wood open. Oh. Available to export? No. Um, I need to open the trade route to Biblis so I can import some wood. They buy stuff I can't sell. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. So here, I already set it up to accept. That's not the one. This is the one. I already ex set it up to accept some wood. I'm going to import 100 at a time. We're not in a rush to import wood. We don't need to keep a steady stock of wood. What we're gonna do, go back to commerce. We are going to import to maintain a hundred. Nothing more than that. It's fine. Straw, I would like to import. I import, uh, it's from Per Widget, right? Yes, open water trade route to Per Widget. We want to import straw. Straw we won't keep a lot either. We are going to keep, uh, let's say 400. One square of our um, storage yard will be dedicated to that. Reserve commerce. We are going to import to maintain 400, let's say. And then clay, we're going to jump it up. I'm gonna fill up that storage yard because we're going to increase our production of stuff. S production, one more potter, please. And then we're gonna do some brickworks. I don't know how much I can feed with all of the imports I plan to do. We'll see. This is for brewers. Maybe I do more bricks though. Please do! Oh, beautiful. I don't know why you mentioned my granaries. But here we are. Employment is still pretty low. You know what I should do? More uh, beautification, but I don't have it in me right now. We might need to set up another housing district at some point. Oh, you know what we should do, actually? Uh, let's do a warship. Let's do our first warship. We should start setting up some military as well. Out in the desert, probably. We have a fort here, maybe. I don't know. I might do a culture dump over here, maybe. Have houses here and just a culture dump. That might be a thing I do. Oh, speaking of culture, I never did a dance school, did I? I don't want to do it here. Maybe here? Oh yeah, that's perfect. Dance school right here. It's not very desirable, so we're gonna need to add desirability at some point. I don't know why I, added, why I focused on adding the desirability here and not here, when this is the main housing district. What do they need, out of curiosity?
I think this is trying to say that... Um, I think it's trying to say that... Oh, okay. Scribal School or Library. Yeah, I did indeed not set this up. Okay. Well, we're going to... We've increased Papyrus. We can't sell this much, apparently. We're going to add this Scribal School, then. Alright. It'll probably manage to get some scrolls sometimes. Going to add one papyrus maker over here. I was keeping this open so I can add more reed ca uh, gatherers if I need to, but it seems like we're fine right now. I guess we're gonna have to wait now, because if we go into dead again, we're gonna get a slap on the hand or something. I don't know. We need to wait for some money to go in. Alright, they're not getting the... These things are not getting started because they're not getting workers for some reason. I don't like it. I'm gonna add some work camps like right here. You are going. I mean, the flood just ended so they're gonna send to farms first but... Um, I need workers to make it here. I don't know why they weren't sending workers there, but they should be now. Can the, the, These guys can make it all the way here, sure. Uh, I changed something else and I'm not sure I remember what. Oh, something I wanted to do too. I think I forgot to give them a uh, dentist, so here we are. Let's have some more shrines. Did I put a plural there? I meant just a singular shrine right there. Um, right here. It's gonna be here. There's gonna be a tiny garden right here, and then there's gonna be cats! Meow! Um, well, I don't have houses here yet, but I do plan to at some point. Cats, though. Very important. I mean, this is a physician. I'm putting more down more cats than I really need to. There we go. Beautified! Hell yeah! I should try to set up a um, a plaza. Hold on. Maybe we can do something with the plaza later. But for now, I'm just gonna set it up so that I can do a uh, festival. Maybe. Hello, Mr. Trader. Welcome to the plaza. Um, overseer. Hmm? Deliver. Religion! This is the one. Let's do a new festival. Oh, I can't do a grand festival. Let's do a lavish one still. We've got nine of these, two of those. This is 1500, and this is. Uh. Uh, hold on. Two of them is 750, so four of them is another 1500. Yeah, we have enough uh, religious... We have enough religious coverage for the rest of this. Uh, I think once I had... Once I add houses here, I'm gonna have the... Um, all the population I need for the actual mission. Out of curiosity, that's wrong. Out of curiosity, what are our ratings currently? 
Culture is what I need. Prosperity is what I need. We need to build stuff and then we need to answer more requests. All right. Okay, what is there? We have our first warship. Let's build more. Let's have a warship wharf right here. I can build all of them, really. So one, two, three up there, four, five, uh, six. I'll just add road access. You went the wrong way. Go this way. Oh, good. He went the right way. One additional worker. Oh, these take workers. I see. I think... I think I already have my ratings other than these. Now, the question is, why are these not going... Oh, I guess they need road access, huh? Did not consider that part. All right, well... It's going to be ugly, but here we are. Um, just let me put this here. You're not spawning anything over here. Okay, good. That was dumb. I was wondering if you needed to have road access on these, and I guess you do. I wasn't sure. Okay. I think what we can do, overseers, because pottery is worth a decent amount, right? Let's... Oh, I can't export it? Okay, never mind. I'm not going to open a trade route just to export it, but I was thinking maybe we can export our excess. Uh, we're going to add maybe a brickwork. We're going to add as well, I think. For the heck of it, we're going to add a few more barley farms. Close to this, because that's where it, like, that's where it floods. Again, just a few more barley farms and more breweries. Um, breweries. Okay, maybe that's not a few. <laughs> maybe I should add more. Uh, let's add, like, more. I'm doing them way back here, because that's where it floods. Again, that's where it's going to be the most fertile. Dead? Oh, I managed to find dead. I shouldn't make the money back. Real, res, reasonably fast. Unemployment is at 4% somehow. Speaking of... Oh man, I'm going to debt again. I shouldn't have done that because I'm barely going to be out of debt and then I'm going to have to add work to all of these fools. You know? Yeah, here we are. Bum, ba -da -bum. These are almost full. It's about time I figure this one out. Am I still in the negative? I'm making Deben, I swear. I'm just not making it at every time. Okay, here we go. Um, rip this dude. At least all the barley made it out. Oh shit, well, we're wasting some, oh no we didn't, look, there's still space here, so we didn't waste any bricks. It's just, you know, it's about time we, um, we get started on laying some bricks over here. Do we have unemployment? No. People are moving in though, we're gonna be fine soon. I shouldn't have added so many brewers. My bad. 
Mm. Right, I'm gonna add another storage yard of bricks. Because I didn't get the master bus started in time. I mean, if if I had connected the road from the very beginning, it would have been in time, but I didn't. So here we are. Once I have some um, some unemployment, I'm gonna add some work camps to tr some work camps and some uh, bricklayer guilds, just to speed it up a little bit. I'm gonna focus on that a tiny bit. Um, we're producing all the pots we need. We're producing all of the everything we need, really. How? Oh, thank you, Os Osiris. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Generated 240 debens of tax. Tax is not a very lucrative way of making money. Well, it is when you're taxing the very rich houses, which we've never seen before. Yeah, look, see? It's, it's better in placements than here. Here it would be getting no... no water. What do you mean you don't have road access? You have... You're an idiot. Sometimes when you modify their... Oh, it just doesn't see it? Alright, well, I, I guess I'll put it here then. Jeez. Perfect flood expected. Cool. Yeah, thank you, Osiris. Again. Appreciate it. Uh, do we have some... I mean, we're going to have some, some unemployment soon enough, right? So, I'm just gonna add... A few work camps. And then I'm going to add a couple bricklayers as well. Oh look, the bricklayers are here already. You're farming on the wrong one. I don't know why I prioritize this one when it's the worst one. <laughs> oh my god. I, I have money again. Let's add... Uh, I imagine it takes... Yeah, it takes workers too. I want to get my land military started. Out of curiosity, my ratings probably plummeted because I added people? Not really. Okay, cool. Going to add a... Recruiter. Recruiter and a military academy. This is going to be happening over here. Um, I guess I could import weapons at some point if I feel like I'm making money. I have a ton of money, but I can't. I don't have a lot of space to add uh, workers. I'll be adding desirability, I suppose. Boop. And then, yeah, that's meow! Let me protect you from this desert you'd rather not see behind you. Hmm. Hmm. Well, if I ever need a culture dump, I'd probably put it here. Oh, what is this guy? I can't find a place to live. Oh. I mean... You seem to be heading somewhere. Did some houses devolve somehow? That might be... That, that might be possible, I don't know. People are mostly fine, right? I think the bazaar is just having a hard time... ...getting to these somehow. Here it comes. Should give them all the stuff. Right? Yeah. Fuck. I think she ran out of food. Yeah, she's out of food again. 
God damn it. It's taking her just a tiny bit too long to go buy food, I guess. Food has a hard... It, it, it will eventually make its way there. It's just taking a while. Oh, we're out of bricks. God damn, they've been laid already. Well, it's gonna be a long waiting game. I'll um, see you all when I have something else to, to build up or something. I don't know. Oh yeah, fort, before I forget. Fort, military building. I wanted to do a, an archer fort somewhere. Um, it can be over here. I'm gonna put another one over here, maybe. It's not gonna bother anybody over there. That's two archer forts, that's fine for now. I think we'll want to start importing a few weapons at, and just have an infantry fort as well. Oh, also what we're gonna want is... How are we looking on workers? When we have more workers, I'm probably gonna add some transport ships as well. Like one here and one here. Let's just do it now and just wait for the transport wharf and... Oh, thank you. The harvest will double? Good lord. I don't have the space for all that. But thank you. You know what? Let's build all of them. I can probably build more somewhere else if I really want to. But I probably don't need to anyway. So who cares? Hmm. More people should be moving in eventually. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. That doesn't sound good. All right, well, back to ba back to cutting. We've set up a bunch of stuff. Some military is gonna uh, happen at some point. I, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna import some bricks too. I think just to speed it up a tiny bit. I think we have the money for it. We're not gonna be spending on building stuff as much. We might as well. Uh, bricks available for import. Import. Uh, you know what? Import as needed. That might be a problem. I'll have to keep an eye on money. I'll let you know if it's a problem. But for now, we continue. And I cut to when something interesting happens. I won't do a time lapse, lapse of just waiting. <laughs> That's kind of silly. I did that early in the playthrough, but not anymore. We only time lapse the building of the city. Okay, so I went into debt <laughs> building something that might look decent. It kind of does. I don't know. Those are all plazas, which means, yes, those are all roads. This is a little messed up. This is a little messed up. And this is a little messed up. Because they're still building. But, you know, we're getting there. Sorry, I thought, I, I thought I'd show you what I did now that I'm in debt. Here's what I went in debt for. Like, pretty plazas. Building this many plazas does, you know, cost a bunch. But hey, it looks alright, I think. It's it's pretty okay. There's gonna be a statue here, just like this one. This is going to complete the garden. When you have a four a two by two of garden, it becomes a like a, a unit. Just like plazas, for example. Uh oh yeah, and like we sent beard and stuff. I don't know, I thought I'd just check in and let y'all know what's going on. The army is uh Oh, okay, it's going here. Yeah, okay, the army is on the way, the everything is on the way. I haven't found any excuses to keep building other than that. I don't know what I'm going to build next time I want to build something. All the industries are doing well. Well, maybe linen could use a little bit of help, but I guess I'll put it here or something. It's the closest I can really make it. I'm just going to do that. Let's do a few more weavers. Oh, employees needed. Uh oh. Oh, and and there. Okay. Well. <laughs> uh, oh no. This again. Yeah, that's a bug. It's seeing the entry point as being. God damn it. It's seeing. There you go. Just delete and redo it, I guess. It tends to consider the ferry as an entry point or something. Oh yeah, my boats are kind of done too, aren't they? Hell yeah. I and I'm trading. 
Yeah, alright, anyway. Maybe I could, like, put statues or shrines or something here and there to... spruce things up a little. I don't think I should go into debt again for it. Oh, there we go. Just made $2,000. I guess some stuff got sold to Mr. Boat, the, the merchant? I don't know. Anyway, I'll go back to cutting. Our long and dangerous trek here was for nothing. The city won't trade. What? Look at all the things we traded. You're an idiot. I don't know what he's saying. Our long and dangerous trek here was. You bought all these things and you gave me 400. Oh my god. This game, this, bleh, this game can be dumb a little. Alright, I added a brick person. Maybe I should add more. Because, uh. We do tend to go dry on bricks. I think that's the main hold up. Then again. Still waiting for people to go in. By the way, we got food to some of the houses finally. These houses got food. These two tiny huts are the only thing, only place that have has not gotten food yet. Yeah. This is about as high level as it can be, and this... We need a second type of food, but I don't think we are going to evolve them. We're fine. We've got the requisite number of... Uh, um, people. I'm going to free up 20 workers. There you go. Fixed it. Alright, I'm gonna add some uh, shrines because I'm rich again. Might as well praise the god, whatever he may be. I got space here. I don't need anything out of here, but I, I got space there. Oh shit, I did not know that this could happen. My income's gonna go down. Oh no, maybe I shouldn't spend on making gardens every bloody where. I don't know, what do you think? Yeah, I think so too. Let me just stop real quick, right after this. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> Uh-oh. I guess I'm gonna increase wages or something. I am rich, so, you know, it's fine. There's a worker's overseers, right? Yeah, is that where we do it though? No. Oh, I got 40 people unemployed. I could have my work camps back. Where did we do it? Not granaries. What's the granary doing? Census. We're mostly working age. Lots of kids. Society. I don't know what this graph is. What is this graph? Oh, is this in what level houses of housing are we living in? That might be it, actually. That might be it. That's the history for population. Oh boy, we don't produce enough food according to the game, but then again... We're fine? Question mark? I think it's because our granaries are full, so the production slows down, right? Because it can't produce more because it's waiting for granaries to be full, uh, to be empty. Yeah, anyway, I'm not too worried. Oh, I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting to what I was doing. What was I doing? Workers, no. This, city health is perfect. No, no, nothing happening. We eat more than we produce. You're lying. I can't empty my... I just physically can't empty my granaries and everybody's staying fed, so... You are lying to me. We don't need this military... We got cats and spiders. I guess I could build more forts. Oh, there it is. No, that's my salary. God damn it. Ratings? No. Commerce? No. Granaries. Public health? There's only one variety. What can I say? I'm seeing all of the patients. 
Yeah, I didn't give a school... You know, I could add a school, actually. I could add a school over here. I don't mind. It's going to eat... It's going to eat a few more papyrus, but it's fine. Uh, I'm still forgetting what I'm trying to do. Yeah, a thousand out of... Okay, well, I'm, I'm you know, perfect. <laughs> I don't know how that happens, but sure. Uh, above average, yeah. I, need, I would need more juggler stages. I would, need more, I, I would need more of all of these, but not a ton more. I like this, because from my memory, you needed a ton of juggler stages to really cover your city. But it seems like they've calmed down a little on this. Which is good. They changed the numbers. I'm still not where I need to be. Treasury? Oh, I found it! I want to pay more than the kingdom. Ah! There you go. Yields an estimated 4,000. Yeah, it's not terrible. But, like, you compare that to... Um, the 13,000 from last year? Yeah. I don't know. Not the same, you know? Alright. I'll continue. Uh, the These things are, like, coming along. I increased... I, I gave myself more brick workers, too. It feels like I'm importing an, enough to support them, so... In fact, I'm looking at this and it feels like I can do more, so let's just do more. Cool. Even more! Oh, yes, please. Thank you. Alright, we're, we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. Cool! We found... We, we finished one. We finished this one. Excellent. It's one down. It's absolutely one down. I need to do this before we continue. Are the other ones almost done? Four thousand. So ten. Okay, well, no, we're not quite almost done. This one just finished first. All right, fine. He's trading. Oh, well, I'm not buying meat, but thanks for letting me know, I guess. All right, back to cutting until the next one's done. Hey, it's done. Eleven thousand bricks, and then four thousand, which means this is the last one, I think. Oh, hey, oh yeah. Hold on. Oh shit. Well, there we go. Pharaoh smiles at your accomplishments. You have made the most of what the river and sea have to offer. Defending our borders <laughs> with a small but capable fleet of ships. You have also honored the nobility by providing them with tools to house their bodies. <sighs> that went well. I like my city here. Hold on, I need to finish the beautification over here. Wait, no, that the road here is very relevant. Beautification garden here it becomes a very ugly garden, unfortunate. And we finish the plaza here. And then we can, I mean, disconnect this. No one likes this. I could destroy all this, but then my unemployment would shoot up. So I'm just going to keep it there for now. I mean, we're done here, right? Look at this. Look at this beautiful city. It's all packed. Full of things that are happening. And I could still build so much more on this side, too. And down here, I had some space for more culture or something. I don't know. And then here, too. I could... Right now, these are not evolving because they want a courthouse. I could fit one right here, I think, if I delete the houses here and the hippos. Because that's a 3x3. Three three. So I could have evolved them too. Decided not to, but you know. Because I have the, the things. I'm not sure if kicking all these people out, but then evolving these is going to make up for the difference. Maybe, maybe not. I, I feel like I'm good. They have pretty good living conditions. They're not getting taxed. So, you know, it's fine. It's, it's, it's wonderful. Life is good, I think. Even on this side. Life is even better on this side, although you're getting taxed for it. But anyway. I digress. That's gonna be it for a, a, jed, a jed do. Next mission. Actually, I lie, because next mission is not gonna be... Abu, or even Salima Oasis, which was on the map last time. Next mission is going to be Bedet, which I'm going to do through mission selection. 
and then we'll go to the Old Kingdom stuff. One thing at a time, you know? So, uh, we'll see about that next Blah. We'll see about that next time, though. So, until then, see y'all.